Thank you for choosing to watch Pablo and Kids. And if you're just joining us, I'm Pablo, the Merchant of Happiness, the show host. And with me is Kanje, who's the DJ, and also my fact master and sidekick who keeps me in line. Well, this show is brought to you by Sam's Foods Industries, the makers of Uganda's finest snacks. If you want biscuits, if you want crisps, if you want, they also have toke barbecue flavor on the market. It's their latest. Make sure you go to the nearest supermarket and ask for sums and if you go to a supermarket and you don't find a stall for sums rush to our website that is www.sums.ug and let us know the place so that we can make sure that we can bring sums to that supermarket or if symptoms persist you can also order online that is www.sums.ug and sums is s-u-m-z or s-u-m-z dot org and if you're ordering for goods worth 60,000 and above and you're in and around Kampala they can deliver them at your doorstep well we are excited people celebrating birthdays if your birthday is around the corner well happy birthday to you statistics have proven that those who have more birthdays live longer and yes just in a few weeks i do believe just a few weeks from now it's gonna be dj kanje's birthday yo man are you looking forward to your birthday yeah Hey, you're looking forward. Ah, in fact, on your birthday at Pablo and Kids, we have a super present for you. We are going to give you an air ticket fully paid to go to Ukraine. Not so? No. You don't want to go to Ukraine? No. Why? Uh, um, the war. The Why war. do you want to go to our... I'm, I'm not a journalist. <laughs> journalists are not to go to war. Journalists go anywhere. Hey. Anywhere there's danger, okay. and uh, that whole Ukraine war is just hey, you okay? Ukraine, Russia, who do you support? <laughs> I think I will support Ukraine. Ukraine, yeah, why? Uh, okay, so it goes back because, um, Russia, how it is right now, it's big, and they should be happy with that. But like, Russia used to be way bigger than that, and yeah. Ukraine used to be part of Russia. Uh -huh. It was called the Soviet Union, SS USSR, United yeah. Soviet Socialist Republic. Yes. Yeah. So it was part of them. So now they are fighting to get them back. Mm. Ah, and you feel that that's not fair to them. It's not fair. Russia. Ah, Russia is always, you know, <laughs> and Ukraine. <laughs> this is like, serious. Mm. This is serious. Don't you smell that it might start like another world war? <laughs> Huh? That's my greatest fear. The way the world wars were started. Hey. Um, in 1914, the First World War mm. was started with the assassination of Archduke Ferdinand and his wife Sophie. Hey, who yeah. were they? Ah, uh, the Archduke of um, was it Belgium? I'm not sure what country, but he was like he was like a leader hey. or in Europe. Hey. And then he was killed. And then, then country started fighting. He was like, it's this one, then this one will get offended. Uh, mm. it, it started the world war. Yeah, judge, 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 it started. Shooting guns, da, da. Eh. And that, in that time, yeah. it wasn't Hitler, it was Kaiser William II. Yeah. Yeah. Now, when did Hitler come in? When you talk of world war, people think of Hitler. Hitler came in in World War II. Yeah. World War II started because of Germany's invasion of Poland. Uh-huh. What were they looking for? They're looking for Polish? Mm, no. Yeah. I think he was like jealous of the USSR. Hey. So he was like, why don't we also have one like this? So he came, he stormed, he took... Then all the other countries were like, mm -mm, we can't allow this. So they had the beef? From so, beef to pork? So f so Germany mm. was there alone with um, um, Japan mm -hmm. and uh, who else? Japan and Italy. Mm. And then there was the U.S., which is a very strong one, USSR, mm. and Britain. Uh -huh. So they decided now we fight. Uh -huh. They all fought until like a point when Germany was kind of like winning. Mm. Germany mm. also... That also was under hit Hitler. Yeah, yeah. Hitler took over Israel, killed like... 40 or 4 million, yeah, 4 million Jews, about like 4 million Jews. And then 
he used this method. It was a very good tactic. Uh -huh. Lightning war. Lightning war. You know how most people when you, they would he agree with the skies? What? No, 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 no. Yeah. You see how when you're entering a country, you first build boundaries and wait for the enemy to come. This guy would just they would he would be like my whole army, whoever you see in your way, you shoot. Uh -huh. So you go straight, no stopping. Hey, hey. Even the innocent, even animals. Yeah, but no, no, Hitler wouldn't allow. He was an animal lover. Hey, yeah. he loved animals. To, he had two German shepherds. Two German shepherds. Yeah. Hey, maybe that's why they are called German shepherds because <laughs> of him. Yeah. So, how did that war end? Uh, I remember. Uh, also, one of the reasons that uh, that the U.S. got also involved was the attack on Pearl Harbor. Pearl Harbor. Yeah, U.S. military base. Uh huh. In Hawaii, yeah, mm. it was a U.S. military base. They attacked it, and the U.S. got angry, brought in its friends. They started the war. Then at the end of the war, it was in France. Yeah. And actually, the funny thing is that during the war, mm. France built a fake France. France like built in, a fake France. So uh -huh. you see the capital of France, Paris. Yeah. Now they built like. To, to the, guard the enemy away, okay. they got like some big, big guys. They they made a fake France, a fake Paris. Mm. So they came and they attacked and they found there was no one. Up to today, no one knows where fake Paris went. Wow, Paris. Then, I think it's cool out because called <laughs> Paris. It's Paris. Eh? Paris. Paris. Oh, do you know Paris. Paris. Oh? Paris. Eh? This is serious. And what kind of ended the war was when the soul, you see, they would use land. No one would use water. They wouldn't use water that much, unless like for ships and aircraft carriers. I don't think aircraft carriers were there. So they came out of the water and ambushed them. Uh huh. Ambushed so it's who? almost like, um, it's almost like them, they were in France. They knew that we have taken the whole of France. They first rested. Who are those? Those are the Germans, mm. those guys, those, the armed powers, I'm not sure what they were called. Mm. Then came Britain, USA and France. They came, they ambushed them from behind, they weren't even ready for it. Mm. They shot them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they had even developed um, a new kind of weapon in, during that time. Flamethrower. Flamethrower? Not only that flamethrower, but the nuclear bomb also. Was it, what was the flamethrower? Basically, you put like petrol inside like a backpack and then you, you make it, uh, you light it mm. so it looks like fire. Mm. Yeah, it was really brutal. Like so brutal. brutal. They would use that on armies. Eh, eh, so eh. just imagine flamethrowing because you can't, once you have a flamethrower, you basically just, you basically won kind of. Yeah. Then they went on to, to build the, atom, the nuclear bomb or the atomic bomb? Yes, the atomic bomb. They made the atomic bomb. Uh -huh. Woo! Jumped it on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. So Japan, yes, I know Japan. that story yeah. of Hiroshima and uh, Noshachi. Nagasaki. Naha. I know that one. I watched it in a movie. In a movie. I watched it, it was Chuck Norris. I think. What oh, John Rambo, Vietnam. Uh, Nagasaki and who? Hiroshima. Uh, what was the story there now? Mm, Japan refused to surrender. Because mm. Germany had surrendered, Italy had surrendered. But Japan had refused. Yeah. They refused to Surrender remove their to people. Two other people won the war. The USSR, the US, the Allied yeah. powers. So they decided to hammer. They they were like, ah, uh -uh, we are not we are not going. Then then the US was like, okay. Two cities. Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Nagasaki. Many people died. Whoa! There we go. Talking about. Atomic bombs, Kiro, 
Hiroshima. Hiroshima and Nagasaki. And yes, we have to stay clear of this. Thank you so much for choosing to watch my YouTube channel. And yes, remember to subscribe. Remember to subscribe. Yes. And hit the bell to be the first to know when we upload the latest video. Remember as well to share with your friends, relatives, outlaws, in-laws, everybody. And let's be happy together. Happiness is a kidding in me. Diggity. <laughs> I'll see you when I see you.